Hi, my name is Fufana Okelfala, founder of NGO United Action for Community Development. My reason to set up this NGO come from my personal experience. During my childhood, I was all allowed to go to school. My sister were not. Not only my family, it is a whole community issue. We have a three mission to achieve with this NGO. First, peace building. We live in a community where each seven years there is a clash between Muslim and Christian. We call for dialogue, reconciliation, forgiveness. In our workshop, we teach young children to not act the same in the future. The third, second thing is that women empowering, which is very important. Many women in our community are married in very early age and they end up to be widow or divorced with many children without profession. The parent cannot give good education to the children that create many consequences, not only the women, also future generation. They end up to be on the street as a gangster or prostitute or something else. So we need, if you educate women, you educate whole society. The other thing is that uh, environmental issue. Guinea is very rich in natural resources. There is a massive exploitation of the bauxite. But during the transportation of the bauxite to go to capital city, the dust cover all the river where women take the water to do their daily life. And the miner destroy the land of the farmer. With, they cannot defend themselves because they are not educated. We as the actor, we come for the rescue, help them how to get their right and also defend them and engage young people for the future reparation. Because if we don't do that, Guinea is going to be big, big problem for the ecologic issue. And the third thing why we are unique, because we are determined. Gender issue is very, going to be very taboo in my community. It's considered to be Western education. And also from other side, engage to protect the community against government is very risky but we take all this risk to help our community that is why we are unique and also we don't have a ngo in my region only two or three ngo they are not active but we we are active because we do our project with the phone or without phone we do it because we are determined most of all our professional we have a master degree, all of us, so we are engaged voluntarily with the phone, without phone, we are engaged to educate our community.